When I open the Tanakh, I'm an astronaut. A Seferat on an astro clock. Damo to the codes unlock. I'm Latoya Beer and welcome to Pinero's Mind. Okay, now let us talk about the results of the American 2020 election. Now, America has spoken and they chose Joe Biden as their president-elect and Kamala Harris as their vice president. Now, I cannot understand why black Americans are celebrating, especially the black celebrities, because Joe Biden and Kamala Harris, they both have something in common. They've both spent parts of their career hunting and destroying black people using pen and paper. Right? Now, what has happened here is that they are given more power and they have an even greater reach. Right. And there is a popular saying, if someone show you who they are, you need to believe them. And these people have definitely shown black Americans who they are and what they represent. So I cannot understand why black people would be celebrating this win. Right. Especially the black celebrities. No, they need to keep the same energy when these FEMA camps come around and when these vaccination comes around and when the food comes off the shelf, right? And for the love of me, I cannot see Joe Biden being president for four years. And all of this that is happening is so well scripted because I definitely see Joe Biden stepping down in the next couple of months, allowing Kamala Harris to be president. That is what I'm seeing, and I've heard quite a few people saying the very same thing, because all of this is like a big show, and people, they are taking you for nothing but a mockery. You are nothing but a joke, right? Black Americans, you have learned nothing. I don't know if this is witchcraft or you are under some mind control drug, but you have not learned your lesson, right? No, I'm not here supporting Donald Trump or caping for Donald Trump because between Joe Biden and Donald Trump is like Lucifer and the devil. Neither is better, right? No, the Democrats, they are the main supporters of the HR5 Equality Act, and that will be a law right? Whether you want to believe it or not, that will become law and it will effectively legalize adults having sex with children, bestiality and necrophilia, right? So keep the same energy for when that becomes law because notice they use the word equality. They are hiding behind equality in order to destroy humanity, because that is basically the plan. So a democratic win is not a win for democracy, especially for our children, because they are the one will be at the greatest disadvantage. And I'm just someone standing from the outside, looking on what is going on on the inside. And another thing I realized with this election is that between mainstream media and social media, they spent a great amount of time censoring anyone that have anything to say about Joe Biden and Kamala Harris, any form of criticism, right? As if they are above it, but they spent a whole lot of time, right? Dragging and degrading Donald Trump, right? That is what they spent the last four years doing in order to get this win making sure that they put Donald Trump is in the worst light possibly. Not that I'm, I'm caping for Donald Trump, but it is just an observation, right? Because one of them got a Luciferian agenda, clearly, right? No, we need to use critical thinking and connect the dots, right? Because Kamala Harris being vice president is well scripted. It didn't just happen like that. And don't believe that hard work will give you any position. Hard work got nothing to do with this life. Right? No, this is a lose for our children and it is a loss for humanity. And it is so sad that many people cannot see this. But you all should keep the same energy when the most High creator makes his move. Let us not say he's been a bully or he's throwing his weight around when he makes a move to protect his own investments. Right? So we need to all pray and say glory be to the most High.